Yo, what is up guys? JD Zero here, bringing you another Bianchi Theaters Stadium 11 review of basically Assassin's Creed. Now, I heard mixed comments about this, and I just recently watched the movie, and it, it lives up to Assassin's Creed, the video game series. Now, some people were hoping it for it to be basically a straight action film, straight off the bat. But it's like, if you ever played Assassin's Creed, you don't start off straight off the bat as an action game. You talk, and it's sufficiency, and it basically explains what you need to do beforehand before getting into the Atlas and becoming your past self and doing all the action stuff that's in it. So I feel like it stayed true to that story and that's good. So another spoiler alert, basically another unspoiled, well, basically it's like another spoiler alert, but if I'm not going to tell you directly what it is, but it's like another thing where you haven't seen the movie, you might as well go see the movie before you hear what I have to say about this movie. But it's one of those things where, like I said, it's a stick to the story. How you go through the process of being a nobody but you're technically not a nobody because you have an ancestor that was somebody that makes you somebody. And you're a more bigger part of this whole design of this world. So I enjoyed it. Now, I would definitely give Assassin's Creed a 5 out of 5. One being better than Underworld for like who has like at least five movies now compared to Assassin's Creed that just had one movie but Assassin's Creed had what like five, six, seven different games in this series it's still a better movie I feel like it just for Underworld compared to Assassin's Creed so Assassin's Creed nailed it for being based off how they did the game. So, 5 out of 5 for Assassin's Creed. Um, if you enjoy my view, please like, comment, share, and scale bash that like button. And see you guys in the next video. Bye.